So over here in the expert mode, I have a layer with mask applied to it. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to select out portions of this image um, uh, while it is on the mask mode right here. And then I'm just going to go around and apply black color to it. So over here in the color section, you can see that I already have black color selected as my foreground color. So if I were to press alt on my keyboard and backspace, then black color is applied on the selected area. Now I'm going to go around, select and uh, so do a new selection and click and drag around and do another selection. Press alt backspace over here as well and go around alt backspace over here as well. Let me just press Ctrl D right here and you can see that this is the selection that I made. And over here there's some um, uh, so there's some corrections that needs to be done. So I'm going to go around onto my brush tool and while the black color is selected let me just go around and draw around to clean out the masking right here just like this. And this is the final output as you can see just like this. So now what you can do is here you can see that there's this um, uh, there's this uh, main picture right here and there's this mask and let's say what I want to do is I want to uh, turn this mask into a selection. So to do that you need to uh, uh, use an option called add mask to selection and to do that you need to right click and over here you can see add mask to selection is an option. Once you click on this what happens is that a selection is added onto the mask as you can see right here. So now what I can do is I can go around, let me just go around and duplicate out this layer right here just like this and the selection is still active and from the top layer I'm going to go around and remove out the mask. So I'm just going to go around and delete the layer mask right here from the top but the selection is still there as you can see. So now I can use the move tool right here and then move it out and you can see that from the mask uh, I, I made it into a selection and I can move this out over here just like this. So that is how you can add mask to selection inside of Adobe Photoshop Elements. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.